Hey everybody, the Reese Viral here, and welcome back to the Elder Scrolls V Skyrim. Okay. Black guy. You know how to pick your enemies, don't you? Hmm? I didn't give them a black eye or anything. I cut off the damn heads. Get it right, Jesus. Uh, anyway. We're gonna be doing this. Today. Which is, well, when I say this, I mean a night to remember, which is started in this place, and also Argonian Ale Extraction. Which isn't hard because all we have to do is this. Doodly 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 doo. Bloop. Boom, done. Give it to Brenowin. I need to actually have that av uh, not available. Boom. Boom. The only downside is I need to go back into the Bannered Mare in order to start a night to remember, which is a pain in the butt. Oh well, it's fine. I suppose. Branowin, where are you? Hmm. You're up here? <gasps> there he is. Yo, Branowin. I ain't done nothing. What? Why are you looking at me? Here's that special ale you wanted. Well, would you look at that? Argonian ale. My thanks, friend. Here, take this here healing potion. I uh, found it in the temple. I'm sure. I stole something, you stole something, it's fine. We did it! Woohoo! Awesome. Alright. Now back into the Ballad Man, we can start A Night to Remember. Which, A Night to Remember can be probably one of the fastest quests you can do. And also, it's it's kind of a choice. If you want it to be, it will be the qu the quickest quest you'll have. But it can also be pretty lengthy. It depends on how you go about stuff. Either way, the, how we start it is by talking to this guy. If you're looking for a challenge, you've come to the right place. A drinking contest? You don't stand a chance. Ha! We'll see about that. This is a special brew. Very strong stuff. Let's get started. Okay. I'll start round one. Down the hatch. I say, please hurry up. Now my turn. Your turn. Yeah, here we go. One down, my friend. One down. Hmm. And another one for me. Okay. Wait a minute, what? Uh, and how about you? You didn't even start drinking. Whatever, a second drink? Easy enough. So says you. I think I've hit my limit on these things. Tell you what, one more and you win the contest. One more? No problem. Wow, you've really done it. The staff is yours. That's great. You know, you're a fun person to drink with. I know this great little place where the wine flows like water. We should head there. Hey, you don't look so good. Hmm? Uh. And so begins a night to remember. Wake up. Yo, what up? That's right. It's time to wake up, you drunken blasphemer. Hi, Ella. Uh, ugh, my head. Yes, your head hurts, and you don't remember where you are. I'm guessing you also don't remember coming in here and blathering incoherently about marriage or a goat. Which means you don't remember losing your temper and throwing trash all over the temple. Hmm. Uh, was a man named Sam with me? Debella teaches love and compassion, but that doesn't mean we're just going to tell you what you want to know and let you walk away from this. Pick up your mess. Then apologize. And if we think you're sincere, we'll consider lending you aid. <sighs> okay. God, what a bitch. Either way. Oh yeah, I need to actually activate a night to remember. I was going to say, otherwise I won't be able to see what's around. Alto wine. A giant toe. Repair supplies. We need the following to repair the broken staff. A giant's toe, holy water, hangraven feather. Oh. Okay. And more alto wine. Done. Yo, what up? I suppose that'll do. Debella teaches us forgiveness after all. 
even for a drunk like you. I'm not always a drunk, Jesus. Did you, do you remember anything I said when I got here? You were ranting when you got here, but most of it was slurred. You did say something about Rorikstead. Maybe you should take a look there. Aha! Uh -huh. Thank you! Ask about Sam and the staff in Rorikstead. Let's go. Rorikstead's probably the worst part of this quest. Purely because you have to go and find a goat. <laughs> yeah, you have to go find a goat in a t um, and free the goat from a giant. And the worst part is because of the giant. I think what I'll do is just kill the giant. Just sneak and kill the giant. And hopefully the goat won't get away. But it might. I don't know. We'll see. Either way. Go to Rorikstead, which is not far. There we go. Boom. But aside from Rorik, well, once Rorikstead's done, we're nearly, we're already nearly done with the quest. That's what I mean. Like, the quest can be incredibly fast if you're in, if you intimidate people, pay them off or persuade them. You can't intimidate the Temple of Debella people, which is weird. Well, yeah, because you can intimidate everybody else. It's just strange. And obviously, I'm not a very persuasive person, but I'm intimidating. I mean, look at me. How is this not intimidating? I've got a goat on my on my shoulder. I also still look like a starting character because I'm using iron arrows. You, you've got a lot of nerve showing yourself in this town again. What do you have to say for yourself? I have no. I'm sorry. Sorry's not good enough. Not while my Gled is still out there alone and afraid. You kidnapped her and sold her to that giant. That sounds pretty bad. You're damn right it does. I'll never breed another prize-winning goat like Gleda. Oh, it's a goat. And don't you think of coming back to Rorikstead until you get her back from that giant. Alright. Find Gleda the goat. Gleda the goat is right up here. That guy sounded sounded incredibly nice. When I just left, he was like, See ya! Bye, friend! <laughs> Bye, goat fee thief. Actually, if I need to free Gleda from the giant, I should probably use a bow. Mm-hmm. The difference with this quest, however, is the fact that the giant is friendly all the way uh, up until you decide to interact with Gleda the Goat. Yeah, once you interact with Gleda, there he is. <gasps> yes! He becomes less than accommodating. Right, Ebony Bow. Whoop. Where is he at? How stupid is he? Shh. He's facing me, which is not helpful. Don't kill the goat. Oh god. Ah! Oh no. Ah, Jesus. Ayla, what the hell are you doing? I mean, he died, but what the fuck? He didn't even decide to attack him. Yeah, cool, we got that. A horse hide, a giant's toe, snow bear pelt. Cool. Holy crap. Gletter! I want the glass mace back. Thank you. Boom. Gletter! Right, let's go. Okay, Gleda's actually going to follow me now. I've done this before and she didn't follow. Instead, what happened was the giant went to attack me and Gleda ran away. Fun, as you might imagine. I'll just take Gleda back down to the main road and then hopefully... Uh... Gleda? Okay, you're still following. Good. Um... Okay, good. I should just be able to ride the goat. Just ride the goat back into Rorikstead. Then he'll be even more pissed. It's like, what the hell do you think you're doing? Oh god. My goat is not a horse. I don't want to kill the goat either. The thing is, the giant attacked me, Gleda ran away. Whereas this time, wolves are attacking me, Gleda does not give a crap. It's like, oh. Look, it's some wolves. And there's Ayala. What the hell is she doing? Whatever. Yeah, let's go. 
sure we can get back soon. Oh. Okay, sprinting away is a bad idea. Mm-hmm. It seems Gladder doesn't keep up. Alright, well, we did it. Hooray! Well, he realized that I just messed up. I didn't mean to take his goat. Wait, who's that? Who are you? Oh, God. <laughs> he died instantly. And also, Gladder was attacking him. What? No, I just saw somebody, like, really heavily armoured. Just walking in front of here, I was like, oh, it's a guard! And then, it wasn't, it was a bandit chief. Oh, how can I get in here? Oh, bugger. Have you got a fence? Or something, I could open up. I'll just jump on in. Yo, I got your go back. Okay, that's not gonna help. Ah, bugger. How do I get in here? Oh, whoops. Of course. Come on, Gletta. Get out of line and you'll have them to deal with. Hmm? Do you not see Gletta? You talked to Reldith yet? She's like a mother to me. Here's your go. Now can you help me retrace my steps? Gladda! I'm not a scratch on her. Happy day! I still can't figure out why you stole her. You left a note explaining it, but half of it was gibberish and the rest had mead spilled on it. Whoops. Only bit I could make out was repaying Isolde in Whiterun. And even that's mostly scribbles. Guess you could try there. Okay. See you. <laughs> See you. Oh my god, Gleather the Goat's following me still. Oh my god, that's kind of crazy. Okay, no, no, no. The goat stopped. Ah, oh, good. I just noticed there's a giant camp over here, so... May as well? Well, it's not out of the way. Even if it was, even if it was out of the way, I'd still go for it. Oh. A mud crab this far away from the... The water. Weird. Did that mud crab manage to kill a wolf? Are you serious? That never happens. What a weak bloody wolf. Mud crabs are usually the bottom of the chain. But nope, nope, that wolf. That wolf was. Damn. Yeah, I can see one giant. Talking stone camp. Oh yeah, I've actually... There's a lot of stuff I've not discovered over here. But I suppose that's because it's near Morthal. Most of the places i found are between Whiterun and Markarth. Yeah, that's like the most I've explored, anyway. But now I'm not focusing as much on exploring, and I'm also uh, focusing on the quests. Because there's a lot of quests. I want to try and do all the quests that aren't Radiant quests. The Radiant quests, if you didn't know, the ones that repeat. And there's near, near enough infinite of those, because basically the way they work is... Um, they'll just spawn in... They want to back the storm cloaks. They'll get what's coming to them. Oh, okay. I was gonna say something, but now I've lost my thing. Train of thought. Oh, there she is. Um, yeah, I don't remember. <laughs> no, I can't. Ugh. They'll basically spawn in the the enemy you need to deal with with the radiant quest. That's why they're infinite because they just continually spawn them in. By the way. Isolde! You're finally back. Look, I've been patient, but you still owe me. What? It's a fine day with you around. Oh, thank you. Uh Okay, how much do I owe you? It's not about the money, really. I wouldn't have given you the wedding ring on credit if you weren't so obviously in love. But if there isn't going to be a wedding, the least you can do is give the ring back. That was one of my best pieces. Uh do you know what I did with it? You went right out to give it to your fiancé. Don't you even remember where you left her? And after you told me that sweet story of how you met in Witchmist Grove, I can see why she left you. Oh. Find the wedding ring in Witchmist Grove. I'm assuming we've not been here. I've been there. Uh, hang on. Hop. 
Oh my god, we haven't. Holy crap, that's far away. Ooh. Which Mist Grove? I'd probably say the closest place is Crag Wallow. Slope. Jesus. And that's another thing. We've barely explored this game. We've not been in Solitude yet. We've not been in Windhelm. We've not been in Riften. We've not been in Dawnstar. Uh, Morthal. The, th the three places we've been to is Falkreath, Markarth, and Whiterun. Everywhere else has been, like, barely touched. But it's fine. Yeah, it is. Because we'll get through them in the end. It's just going to take a long time. Hmm. I knew it. Wait, what? <laughs> Wait, is that a dragon? Oh god, it is a dragon. Oh, it's a blood dragon. Hey, Yowza! Just land already, you fuck. Mm hmm hmm. Oh. Okay. Nice. Oh Jesus. That's slow down time. <laughs> Don't you see I'm the master of the arcane, bitch? Got it. Woohoo! Oh yeah, shit. Oh, whoops. Crap. Oh, we got him. Ooh. We already know it. Awesome. Hey, Ellie, you're nearly dead. I don't think you can die, though. I'm pretty damn sure she can't. I don't really want to test it. But I'm pretty sure she can't die. Oh, yeah. Right. There we go. I see another dragon. Holy crap, really? Mm. Not even sure what the hell that's attacking. Oh god. No, I can't really tell. Either way. Here is Witch Mist Grove. Oh, it might be a, have been flying around that. Or something. I'm not sure. Oh, it's a wolf. Watch out. Oh, nice. Jesus Christ! <laughs> Holy crap! He just kicks it in the face and then smashes down on it. Alright. Come on. Discovered! Steam crack camp. Yeah, there's also a... a dragon wall thing. Now yeah, this is Witch Mist Grove. Well, we're nearly there, I think. I don't know if there's... Oh, it's a goat? Oh, it's a goat. Witch Mist Grove, here we go. Oh. Oh my god, I've just realised there's a... Hag Raven here. Oh god. That's creepy. Um... Hello? Darling, I've been waiting for you to return, to consummate our love. Ugh. Uh, actually I was hoping to get the ring back. What? You want it for that hussy Esmeralda with the dark feathers, don't you? I won't let her have you. Oh, right, okay. Alright, Moira. Cool thing is, Moira is actually... What's her face? His sister. Is it Agnes? I can't remember what her name was. I'll find out. Do 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 Anise, that was her name. That was her sister. Moira was her sister. 
Wedding ring! And high graph and feathers. Alright, we can take that back to Isolde. Oh, man. Yeah, that, that, that was something I was just like, what? <laughs> we were gonna get married to a hag raven. Yeah. Alright, back to Isolde. Boom. Are you serious? Shit, man, where are the enemies? Oh, there we go. They don't exist. Perfect. Right, we're nearly done with the quest, actually. So that's good. There's only one more quest in Whiterun, and then Whiterun Hold is done. Like, I've, I've done everything within Whiterun Hold. Um... As, as far as, like, um... The quests actually in Whiterun Hold are... Are, like, go. But I'm not sure if there's any dungeon quests there or whatever. Oh. Okay, never mind. I thought, like, a vampire or something spawned. And that was the, the weapon I heard getting unsheathed. But it wasn't, so that's good. Anyway, it's older. Ye don't go in there. It's a fine day with you around. Uh oh right. Here's the ring. Excellent. Sorry it didn't work out. I know how excited you were for the wedding. You kept saying it would be a huge ceremony at Morven Scar. You said you even had some magic staff that would handle all of the guests. Oh. Well thanks. Head to Morvenscar. This is also a place I've not been to. From the sounds of stuff. Oh, it's not far away though. Actually, it really isn't far away. Holy crap. I might as well go to Windhelm Stables and then just go up the mountain. Over there, right there. Alright, well, there you go. Ah. Da 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 da. Right. But there's one quest within Whiterun that I'm not going to be able to do. Well, I, I can do it, it's just the fact it's a quest that's quite hard to do. Essentially, it's a quest that requires you sacrificing people that are close to you. And um, from reading up, it it's a good idea to get a certain spell that allows you to permanently resurrect somebody. Basically. Whoa, why have I got... Okay, it's just two markers that are in the right, the same direction. One will be pointing towards the fort, and the other's pr probably pointing towards Falkreath. Mm-hmm. That's what I would guess. Right, here we go. Mm -hmm. Well, we're right near- right next to the fort, it's just I need to get up the mountain. Oh wow. Oh, I was gonna say you have a lot of health, but you don't. Uh, I like how his eyes just closed. Are they just wolves? Assassin? Why am I getting attacked by the Dark Brotherhood? Astrid? Wait, no. Uh as instructed, you are to eliminate TOW by any means necessary. Black Sacrament has been performed, somebody wants his poor fool dead. You've already received payment for the contract, failure is not an option. Astrid. Oh. Who the hell would have ordered that? Oh, you're... You're not the same... Oh, it is wolves. Thought so. We are all terrible because we missed. Perfect. I like how the assassins just appear out of nowhere. Should be able to take his robes and just infiltrate the Dark Brotherhood. And yes, the Dark Brotherhood do exist. To be honest, it's fairly obvious. Haven't they been a staple in the game for a very long time? The only difference is, the way this game works is you don't get... Not invited. You don't get into the Dark Brotherhood just by simply murdering somebody, because if we did, uh, I would have already been a member of the Dark Brotherhood from just killing that nobleman who was on his horse. Yeah, the way the Dark Brotherhood works in this one is you have to go to Windhelm and speak to... There's a dude there that wants... I can't remember. It's something within Windhelm. I know that much. Yeah, you can, you can create a snowstorm. And now you're dead. Well, 
The mace is mightier than the spell. Oh god, there's a lot of them though. Can you stop calling me a cat? I mean, yes, I'm a Khajiit, but I'm not actually a cat. Oh, well, there goes the head. Boop. Oh, that was a yellow. Okay. There's another conjurer somewhere. Did they run away with their tail between their legs? I don't even know where the fuck they went. Oh, there they are. What the hell? Why did you run away? Oh, well, there you go. We did it! Now I just need to get inside this building. And uh, yep. Perfect. Marvin Scar. Either way. Not too bad. Oh. Do, 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 do. The best part is when this quest is all over and done with, we get teleported. Yeah, we get teleported all the way back. Which is nice. He works the forge. No idea what he summoned, but it's dead now. He also had a staff of, like, shock. Yeah, staff of sparks. Ooh, isn't that cool? Jerem's heart. What the heck? Okay, that's actually a cool, a good thing. Iron ore, silver ore, iron ingots. They have plenty of firewood, too. Thing is, with these stacks, you can't just take them, which is sucky. It'd be nice if you could. Ah, uh, never mind. Now let's go. We need to make our way through this place. Uh, okay. I have marked for death. Maybe that would be a good idea. Glee. I don't think anybody got marked. Sadly. Well, I see a lot of, um... Aha! Hostile markers. Oop. Okay. You missed. Are you serious? Okay, one of these is really good. Okay, one of these is really, really good. Alright, it's this guy that's in front of me. I know that for it. I just know that. For starters. Yep, Arch Pyromancer. What do you know? Oh, Jesus. Fuck. They set off a trap and it killed me. That scared me as well. Right, I should probably use my bow. <laughs> that scared me though. God damn. I don't know what happened. Like, I got hit by the trap, I'm guessing, and that nearly killed me, and then I just got killed by one of the other spells. Mages are powerful bastards. They really are. They drink all day and night. What light? You work the forge. We've been over this. Cool. What's with that noise? There's nobody in here. Yeah, okay, this is where I should probably get my bow. Uh, bow, 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 bow. There we go. Alright, this time I hopefully won't get completely fucked. I mean, I still might, but fingers crossed. <laughs> that was funny, though. I don't care. Like, I, I was only in here for a few minutes, so it's fine. And I just find stuff like that funny. Well, yeah, because it's just like, are you serious? But it's surprising at how good mages actually are. Get ready. Trouble ahead. Yeah. Oh, God. You don't say. Hmm. Oh, there's one. Not going to be able to get them from here. Uh, I fall in slow-mo. Oh, that was close. Jesus. Alright, go! Oh my god, I got them. I don't know if that was the Pyromage or what. Don't think it was. No, I think this might be the Pyromage. No, it isn't. Oh no, it is. It is. Okay, it is. Oh, now I'm spotted. 
Oh, great. And... Oh my god, are you serious? I'm gonna die again. Oh yeah, I don't have any stamina because... They used fucking ice and shite. Ah, run! I was gonna say and hide, but now hiding does not work. If I can take them out one by one, that's fine. There you go. Shh. Shh. Yeah, you probably will. Okay. Running away like a bitch. Worked. Seemingly. Kind of. 